Hi hey everyone, Chad Troop here, and thanks for tuning in to my video today. I'm going to be talking about big scary stats, or as I, I like to call them, BS stats, because a lot of times they can be misleading and cause you to do knee-jerk reactions that don't always benefit you. So before I jump into my video today, I just want to make sure that you have a chance to subscribe to my channel. You can scroll below, click subscribe, and if you enjoy the content, just give me a thumbs up to let me know. Now before I jump in, I wanted to know if you have experienced any of these BS stats that cause you to take any sort of initial reaction that ended up being the wrong move to make, you can leave me a comment below and let me know your experience with these big scary stats. Because the one I'm gonna talk about today is the inversion that happened just the other week. We saw the two year yield briefly cross above the 10 year yield and that is a major inversion. And we've seen the headlines lately talk about this yield and this inversion because it has a 100% accuracy rate of predicting recessions. Now this is a BS stat, not because it's inaccurate, but because it lacks a lot of context behind what goes into this stat, because when you look at it, the 100% accuracy rate is pretty strong, but it doesn't tell you the time frame for which this recessions actually take place after the inversion happens. When you dig down into it and you look at the research, it's actually on average about two years later that we'll actually see the recession. So now here we are in 2019, that means we could be out in 2021 or 2022 before this recession would even come up yet the headlines are all screaming that their recession is imminent and that now is the time to panic. And that's kind of the tone that's set through mainstream media. But when you look at how the S&P 500 has performed from now until the recession, or even just over the next 12 months, we see a nice strong rally in the stock market. So it tells us that now is not the time to panic and instead to jump in and buy stocks here and benefit from the rally that's about to take place over the next 12 months. And in fact, that's actually what I did two days after the Dow plunged 800 points and this is right after the yield inversion we jumped in and we were buying call options and the one in particular was call options on nvidia and those jumped 45 percent in just one trading day handing us quick gains and the only type of gains that you can see by buying options on these quick pullbacks so that's actually the recommendation that i would make that when you see these dips and on these big scary stats like that that it's a great opportunity to come in and buy options on great stocks to benefit from the rebound. And I'm actually looking to recommend more call options here in the coming weeks to benefit from this rally that I was talking about that we're expected to see over the next 12 months. So if you wanna learn more about that, I'll have a link below that you can click on to join us and to figure out how we're gonna take advantage of this rally and also be prepared when the coming recession finally takes place. So that's all for my video today. I hope you enjoyed it. And again, make sure that you subscribe to my channel. You can click the bell to get a notification whenever a new video is posted. And until next time, I'm Chad Chu.